We've done it. We found the tech angle to Formula One racing, or rather a startup called Beyond Math has. Beyond Math has created a physics-based AI simulation that can speed up the process of production for vehicles like trains, planes, boats, and yes, F1 cars. Here's how it works. Beyond Math is working in the field of computational fluid dynamics, which refers to the extremely complex ways that we interpret how an object moves through water or air, or the air around an object. With supercomputers and GPU clusters, some companies have harnessed the computational power necessary to simulate how air might flow over a wing, for example. But it's not that accurate and it's hard to pull off. So a designer might try to create a new car part and run simulations to see whether it works effectively. Then they bring it into a wind tunnel, but since it's hard to simulate fluid dynamics, it still just might not work, even if the trials seem promising. This is why what Beyond Math is working on, which is a way to simulate those wind tunnel tests, could be so revolutionary. The startup wants to make the digital design stages quicker, which means there's less of a delay between conceptualizing an idea and knowing if it'll work. Beyond Math co-founder Darren Garvey told TechCrunch, quote, imagine you've got six months to design a part for a plane. Given that a simulation takes so long, you might get 20 attempts to try things out. But if a designer thinks of an idea and gets results within seconds or a couple of minutes, in that same six months, you might be able to run a million changes. What makes Beyond Math's tech different from the existing simulators? Beyond Math is using machine learning instead of just using more GPUs. There's a precedent for this. Some researchers have been able to use machine learning to more accurately model natural disasters. The idea is that hopefully, Better modeling of earthquakes or hurricanes could give us more information about why, when, and how they form, and maybe we'll get better at predicting them. Here's where F1 comes in. Some Formula One teams, which Beyond Math is not naming, want to use the software to speed up the process of designing the most aerodynamic vehicles possible. Garvey told TechCrunch that the company is getting close to having a platform that can actually make cars faster, and he hopes that within six months, the company will be able to show proof of how customers are benefiting from their tech. To help Beyond Math get its tech to the next level, the company just raised an $8.5 million seed round led by Up Partners with participation from Insight Partners and InMotion Ventures. So if F1 cars start looking a bit different down the road, Beyond Math could be responsible. 